some, it was a night out with friends last night. Others were celebrating a late Father's Day. But the evening at Jay Alexander's Redlands Grill right near Oxmoor Center turned violent, with two people shot right in the parking lot and then sent to the hospital. Tonight, for the first time, we are hearing from those who were inside eating last night. Dennis Ting has been following this story today. He's been talking with the witnesses who were at the restaurant and what they did next. Dennis? Well, Doug, witnesses tell me it was a busy night here at this restaurant when a shooting outside the J. Alexander's injured two people. Now, both those people are expected to survive, and witnesses say they're fortunate the shooter didn't go inside the building. Gone are the flashing lights, the police tape, the crime scene markers. But the bullet holes and shattered windshields remain in the parking lot outside J. Alexander's Redlands Grill by Oxmoor Center, remnants of Monday night's shooting. My first thought was... <laughs> This is, this is how I'm going to die. Christine Lindsay says it was a full house at the restaurant, a 45-minute wait. She was there with her friends enjoying a night out. I had my jacket on, my wallet was in my hand, was getting ready to leave, and um, heard pop, 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 pop right outside the door where we were sitting. Christine says she and her friends got down on the ground and tried to find cover. People came barreling through that door from the patio just knocking over chairs, came running in, and someone said, shoot her. Christine didn't see what happened, but another diner says she saw a person carrying what appeared to be a rifle outside. They were just shooting, just kind of randomly, just up, 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 just shooting sort of in the air. Louisville Metro Police say the shooting happened around 8.30. A man and a woman were hit by bullets and taken to the hospital. Police still don't know what the motive was for the shooting, but one witness says at least one of the victims appeared to have been leaving the restaurant when he was hit. What I saw was um, a customer who was outside and he looked like he had been caught in the crossfire and um, shot in the calf. Police did find a gun at the scene, but they don't know whether it was used in the shooting. Louisville has already seen more than 320 non-fatal shootings this year. It was a very surreal experience. It was very frightening. In a statement, the restaurant writes in part, Redlands Grill is deeply saddened by the random shooting incident that occurred outside the restaurant this evening. Our thoughts are with the victims of these senseless actions. Now, police are still looking for suspects. Anyone with information is asked to contact police through the anonymous tip line 574-LMPD.